Today we're going to show you how to use the EGX360 to create beautiful custom engraving on glass wine bottles. The EGX360 makes it easy to engrave a multitude of gift and jewelry products, able to engrave cylindrical objects made of glass, crystal, and metal, the desktop device is the most versatile gift engraver on the market. For today's application, we'll be using a computer with Engrave Studio software and the Roland EGX360 along with the proper jigs and cutting tools. We'll begin by setting up the machine. The handy panel makes it easy to enter the proper parameters for access switching, revolution, AutoZ control, and more. Next we'll set the engraving tools. First set the 1 8 inch solid collet. For glass, we'll be performing wet engraving, so set the water nose attachment and the hose. Now pour about one half liter of water into the tray. Next we need to measure the outer diameter of our bottle. Take a note of the measurement. Set the bottle into the engraver. The EGX360 comes with four sizes of cup cones. Choose the one that best fits the bottle and set it in place. Install the flat plate and close the cover. Using the handy panel, move the spindle unit X0A0 position to the front of the engraving area. Select Y0 to move the spindle on top of the work. Adjust the vise unit so that the distance between the water nose attachment and the surface of the bottle is about one quarter of an inch. Turn the pump on. On the handy panel, hold down the spindle on-off key to start the spindle spinning. Wait until the water starts to run down onto the surface. Once you've confirmed that the water is running properly, stop the spindle. Select Area in the Handy Panel menu. Choose two points in Diagonal to set your work area. Press the Enter key to confirm the work area. The laser pointer will move to the next corner each time you press the Enter key. Your work area is now set. To create the design, launch Engrave Studio. This powerful, easy-to-operate package comes bundled with the EGX360. Select Cylinder in the Material Setup and type in the diameter of the bottle you measured earlier. Click on the area icon to import the area set by the machine. Create the design you want to engrave. Set your rapid clearance gap at 3 mm. Go to the Tool Paths tab and click on Quick Engrave. For this project, we'll be using the Rotating Diamond Cutter. Set your feed rate at 20 mm per second and your plunge rate at 10 mm per second. Finally, create the toolpath. Set the depth pressure at 1 mm and output the toolpath to the machine. Next, do a final confirmation of the output area. Press Menu to exit the preview mode. For this engraving project, we'll be using a burnishing attachment and a rotating diamond cutter. Set the tool. Lower the spindle to set the distance between the spindle and the work to about 1 8 of an inch. Turn the spindle control knob to a spindle speed of 12,000 RPM. Press the copy key, then OK. Select Cut to start engraving. The EGX360 will perform precise engraving along the curved surface of the bottle. After the engraving process is complete, select View and remove the bottle from the machine. That's it! Your bottle is beautifully engraved with a custom design. Thanks for joining our workshop today. Remember, you can view our entire video workshop series and register for Roland University online at www.rolanddga.com.